Hello everybody, let's talk about feedback mechanisms and feed forward mechanisms and how they affect how your brain interprets information from your body and how chiropractic can actually help with that. So I'm Dr. Sarah, I'm a chiropractor from Elk Park, Illinois, and let's talk about this. So there are mechanisms present in your nervous system that will amplify an effect or they will calm down an effect, right? And those amplification, those feed forward mechanisms and the calming mechanisms, the feedback mechanisms are supposed to exist in balance. And so that balance is maintained by that autonomic part of the nervous system and by a couple of interesting other mechanisms. But for the sake of a three minute conversation on TikTok, here we go. When you experience a spasm, that is kind of a feed forward mechanism, right? You don't have the shut off information that is going to let that muscle like relax and release, right? And so that can happen for one of a couple of basic reasons, right? One, you have a shift in the joint space and your body's like, oh my God, I got to grab it, right? Because I can't let you move this joint space so much, right? So I'm going to feed forward and I'm going to shut that down. I'm not going to let you move it. So that's one reason. So the feedback mechanism, so like that happens sometimes in fibromyalgia people, in people with uh, dysautonomia, you'll adjust them and all of a sudden they'll get really, really tight and it'll take some time for that to work itself out, right? Usually I put them on a vibe plate, 10 minutes should be pretty well gone and that vibration is what helps it unwind itself because what you're doing is you're flooding the joint space information the joint spaces you're flooding that with information from that vibration and you're overwhelming the feed forward mechanism it's the same reason you shake your hand when you hit it with a like a hammer or something so the feedback mechanism happens when also same thing you have a joint it slips let's say right because you have instability because you don't have balance between stability and strength so when that joint slips and it comes apart, all of a sudden your, bra your brain is like, oh my God, I can't let you move it. I'm going to take all the power away from it. And that's when your leg is like, I'm not going to work right now. So that is what I experienced significantly after childbirth. I really couldn't put a lot of weight on my right leg. I could walk, but like I could not use my right leg to go upstairs. And it was because I had so much instability in my right SI joint that every time I would try to do that, it would slip and my body would say, oh no, girl, you're going to hurt yourself if you put stuff through it. So I'm just not going to let you do that. I'm going to depower your leg. Feedback mechanism. So anyway, chiropractic can help you because chiropractic helps you balance those mechanisms and gives you an ability to balance that strength and stability.